Well, hello friends. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be opening some Happy Mail. Um, as you can see, it's been accumulating. <laughs> uh, I'm going to get right into it because um, I have a few envelopes to open. Now, um, this one is from Paper Terrace, who is Jessica. Um, Paper Terrace is her YouTube channel name, and I actually support her on Patreon. So, and she sends her Patreon members a, a happy mail every month. This one is from um, April. It was actually sent April 21st. And uh, yeah, and I've been waiting to open it on camera. So it's been sitting, <laughs> waiting to be opened. So let me go ahead and how cute. She always sends a sweet little something. Looks like there's a little note, which I will read. Look at the cute little lamb. How sweet is that? So, yeah, she just included a note. I'll read it later. Um, but look at this. A little snippet that she made. And the beautiful postcard. I believe she gets these on Amazon. And um, if you don't watch her already, I will link her channel below. But, I mean, she's got a pretty large uh, following. So, you probably already you know, know who she is. A very sweet lady. And, um, yeah. So, and this is the one for May. And I, it's postmarked May 14th. So, let's see what she says. I love the postcards that she picks. And here's her little note for May. Look at the cute little fairy. Why am I off center here? I gotta, oh, I know. I have my camera turned around. Okay. Look at this. She stamped on a piece of fabric and sent us that. Isn't that sweet? And a fairy postcard. How adorable is that? Flower fairies. Love it. So, yeah, that is from Jessica at Paper Terrace. All right. Very sweet. Now, this. <laughs> um, I had watched a uh, Christina of um, what is her channel? Is it? I'm drawing a blank on her channel right now. I'm recording this live. It is Tuesday night, and <laughs> I'm tired, but I wanted to get this recorded um, for you to watch on Wednesday. And um, Christina had uh, hauled some wallpaper on her channel. Oh, how gorgeous. And I have plenty of wallpaper. I, I might have, among my many addictions, a wallpaper addi addiction. And when I saw this, I said, that is gorgeous. She offered to share some. So I went ahead and said, I will definitely send you some wallpaper. You know, like trade you wallpaper. So I sent her a few sheets of my different wallpapers and then she sent me all this beautiful wallpaper look at that that is gorgeous i would have totally picked this up if i had seen it out there and it's very textured it's almost like it feels like it's painted you know like a painting actually this would be beautiful to frame a portion of it and i may just do that and it's got little strawberries i love it so that is from christina and she did open um the paper that I sent her and uh, I don't know why she felt like she needed to send me some more happy mail so she sent me some more happy mail and as you can see I have not opened it and I'm showing the backs of the envelopes because you know obviously I don't want to show the addresses but look how cute she put a little felt heart at the middle there I mean at the bottom <laughs> uh, I'm laughing at myself because you know middle bottom I'm like yeah, my brain's a little bit not working. Oh, oh my goodness. Look at this. She put everything in a little baggie. I hope that you enjoy these extra goodies. Of course. Oh my goodness. How fun is this? Ooh, I'm already seeing stuff I love. Okay. Well, you know, even the index card, I have to keep a look at these. A little doily looks like it may have been cut off off of a larger one some beautiful ribbons 
Oh, she tied them. Oh, how, yeah, that's that's a nice way to do it. So she tied these with a little piece of jute twine. Oh, look how fun this one is. Yeah, and then this lace. Oh, gorgeous. Thank you so much, Christina. I love it. And then look at this. She tied the paper stuff with another ribbon. So I'm going to put that over here. And this feels like... um glassine that's interesting that it's got the holes this paper um let's see oh some little eyelash trim i love eyelash trim i have a large collection of that too but i don't think i have this um what do you call it ombre ombre color in the pink or it looks like it reminds me of a flamingo right right <laughs> oh, I'm oh I just got an idea I might just make a flamingo with that okay <gasps> look very clever I like to do this too wrap washi tape on a playing card to share washi um I need to make some cards like that because I've got tons of washi but I Oddly enough, don't have any of these. So thank you so much, Christina. I will definitely add that to my washi collection. Ooh, I haven't pulled that little book in a while. I have to find it. But I actually have a little book where I put any washi that I receive, you know, just to keep it. My collection. And look how cute. A flutter by tag. How sweet is that? And then another little tag. It looks like... um. It almost looks like a library card, but it's in the tag shape. Yeah, it's a tag made out of a library card. And it looks like a printable there. Ooh, some more. Nice. Little tags made out of different things. Ooh, a playing card. Okay. Some real tags. Sale price tags. And these are like slashed. So it must be a really good sale. You know, prices slashed. Ha! Huh? <laughs> Okay, and there's some frames, um, stamped frames. This is really cool. Special delivery. Huh. Looks like some sort of postage. I don't know. Wow, I don't know, but it's cool. Ooh, look at that. It's got an actual, like, charm B on there, too. How cute. It says, be happy. How sweet. Sweet. It opens up that way and this way. Oh, that is too cute. And then it's got, oh, that's a pocket and it's got these little papers in it, which are, looks like little scraps from the paper she used for this. That is precious. Thank you so much, Christina. That is beautiful. I'm going to have to make one of these. It's really cool. I love the interactiveness, you know, of how it flips, flips, flips. It looks like it's four pieces connected with washi. So, love it. Very cute. I like that uh, washi. It looks like beehive. <gasps> and look, a little journal. Oh, my goodness. It's made out of, um, that looks like uh, pattern paper. Maybe glued onto some craft paper and a, maybe a printable oh how cool and I think it looks like she may have used um, you know the little foam tape to con connect them that is neat and then a cute little pocket there and some fun combinations of papers that is so precious. I love it. Look at those little parrots. Thank you, Christina. This is adorable. Ooh, love it. And then look at this pretty card. I also have an obsession with greeting cards, of course. It says, fun times ahead. That is so cool. Did you make that? That is really cool. It looks... I mean, the colors, I mean, are so vibrant. <laughs> it almost looks like each piece was stamped, but my goodness, that would be so hard to do. So, but I don't see like a mark. It must have been a card from a set. 
But if you did this, Christina, let me know. Because <laughs> that is amazing. How sweet those beautiful um, goodies in here. I love every single one of them. Thank you so much, Christina. I wish I knew where my um, washi book was, you know, real quick. Because I would just go ahead and real quick, you know, put that in there. But since I'm not going to spend the time to look for it right now. So let's put that away. Thank you again. And then this one was a total surprise. My friend Sue, um, who actually, I mean, I was grateful for her supporting my Etsy shop. She purchased from my Etsy shop. And then the next thing I know, I get this package in the mail from her. And how sweet is that? She sent me some. Let me, she sent me her business card, but I don't want to show it because it's got her information on there. And she sent me some beautiful greeting cards. So that's a post. No, yeah, it's a greeting card. So that for Memorial Day. And it did arrive before Memorial Day. I just um, am now sharing it. Look at this beautiful. It, they look like photographs, you know. A little bear. Uh, see, this is, is that a leopard. A little baby one. And look at that scenic one. Gorgeous. Tell me where it is. Sierra Club. Love them. And they come, and these are the their envelopes. They got the yellow envelopes, I believe. And look at these gorgeous stickers. These look like they might be vintage. You know, just the, the age on them. But look how gorgeous. Birds and butterflies, like two of my favorite things. And then she wrote me a little note, which I did read already. I did open this one before. And then look at this gorgeous, gorgeous card. This one is like a frameable. I love it so much. Thank you, Sue. That is just uh, adorable. I mean, it's a, a cute little lamb. And it's got little butterflies around her. <laughs> I mean, can't get better than that. And look at the gorgeous envelope that goes with it. I might actually just put it, the envelope, maybe like that, and frame it like that. Because, I mean, even the envelope is gorgeous. I don't want to, you know, waste it. <laughs> so, thank you so much, Sue, for that beautiful surprise. I absolutely loved it. And actually, on the day that it arrived... You know, I was having a little bit of a bummer day, and it brought a smile to my face. So the timing could not have been more perfect. Thank you so much, Sue. And then this is from my friend Sherry, Turquoise Dreaming, who um, we do a lot of collaborations together. Or, well, I participate in some collaboration, open collaborations that she hosts such as Tag Tuesday, Thrifty Thursday. And then we've also done others together. And mm, there may be more to come, so stay tuned to my channel. But um, I had mentioned to her when she was working with these papers um, that if she had any, I, I would love to trade with her for some stuff. And she hasn't told me what she wants me to send her, but uh, let me see. Let me see. I'm going to stop and read the note for a sec. Okay. She was just explaining <laughs> why she had to fold them, which is not a problem at all. But um, I had seen her um, working on some, I believe, like Rolodex cards or memory Dex cards out of these um, papers. And they're actually like cardstock. I thought they were more papery for some reason, but they're actually nice cardstock. And I know that she had gotten this because she um, made some comic book um, journals before. But I have a superhero journal that I'm going to be working on very soon. Actually, maybe a couple. How cute. And I thought that these would be great. So I asked her if she would trade with me. You know, whatever she wants. I'm sure. Actually, I don't think she's told me what she wants me to send her yet. <laughs> but, um, yeah, look how cool. These will be perfect to go with my 
superhero journal. So if you're interested in that, make sure you are subscribed to my channel if you aren't already. Because I will have those videos coming up. So once again, here's everything for you know the last couple of months really of happy mail that I've received. And my reason for sharing this is first of all to thank those of you who have sent me something. I really appreciate it. Um, I never want to ask anyone to send me anything. Usually if I do, I offer a trade you know, or something like that. Um, but, you know, I really do appreciate it when you take the time to to send me something. And I share it just because um, I want to share my enjoyment and fun in opening. And I hope that that is fun for you as well. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you have a blessed day. Bye-bye.